gonna set you guys up over here. I got the rear end kind of up. I got to put the tires on, obviously bolted on down. So let's uh, let's get you guys right here so you can watch the action. What do you want to watch it from this side? Is this side more better? Let's try this side. Yeah. I'm gonna jack it up, put the lug nuts on it. I got still got to center the rear end and make sure she's square and all that stuff, but. This ought to be fun. <clears throat> Where are the lug nuts? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I got them all. All right. Here we go. Oh, there's ten. Ten. No dos tres cuatro cinco. That's Spanish for more than four. I think one more than four. Here we go. Oh, I gotta pick this thing up. This rear end's gotta come up. Yeah, see now the leaf springs are hitting the frame. And they're starting to move. There's that dumb block that's on there. I'll show you on the bottom of the frame in just a second what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I'm gonna have to cut that off. And pretend it doesn't exist. Fun. I need to spray these lug nuts. Ugh. They're rusty. The studs are rusty. I'm not playing games. I don't want to burn up my stuff. I can force them on, but I'm not forcing them on. This will be the first time in years I think this thing has actually had a stock wheelbase, factory wheelbase again. I'm pretty stoked about it, actually. If you can't tell, I'm pretty excited. All right, here we go. Oh, stupid Jack. God, this dumb Jack likes to do this. Oh, it's already picking itself up. This stupid jack. I gotta put it on jack stand just to get the tires on. Cause this jack is that bad. It'll set it down. That's all right. I don't mind. I mean, I mind, but. It is what it is. on. Now we can go to this side. Put these lug nuts on these wheels. Yep. I'm definitely going to have to remove that section off the frame. 
I can clearly see it. Oh, spray these down. What am I doing? My wife's home. Perfect timing. Maker Park over there and uh oh, puppy hears her. Uh oh. Molly hears her. I'm just putting these lug nuts on this side real quick. One other thing I didn't think of until just now is when I put the front disc brake on, kit on, I never set up the toe on this car, so it's towed in pretty far, like three quarters of an inch, I'm betting, or more. So before I can roll it outside and look at it properly, that has got to be addressed. So that's the stock wheelbase. Okay. I'll come get you in just a second when we put this stuff away. Let's see here. I need to get my tape measure out. Figure out this base. Hi, babe. Okay, all right. Come downstairs with me, let's look at this. All right, make sure the battery stayed in there, did it? It did, hi everybody. Gosh, you're cute. So this, I gotta cut this off the frame because what I was gonna do is set this down and let this eyelet, as the spring compresses, this eyelet's gonna move this way. And however far it moves down the frame when it's at full weight, but right now this thing is stopping it, so. I gotta cut all this bird crap off the frame right here. That means I gotta jack the car up. And let the rear end hang. So I gotta jack the car up another two clicks probably on the jack stands. Let the rear spring hang far enough for me to cut this off. And then set it back down so this can slide back. That's what I'm thinking. But I think that's going to be for a different video or two or three because I got some measuring to do. I got to figure out the width there off this to figure out the track width over here off of this to figure out which way that's got to go so I can get the tire centered in the fender well. Then I can tighten it down and oh yeah, I might like, yeah, yep, 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 nope. We're not even close. Not even close. Backing plate to spring is three and an eighth on this side. And I guarantee it's not three and an eighth on this side. It's four and a four and an eighth. So it's gotta move a half inch this way and a half inch that way. Half inch. I gotta move them one half inch. One half inch. All right, next time. Bye.